Oh, you into fitness? Wrong place, right guy. I'm Scully, and this is the SoFly Zone. Everything you see here has been shot, edited, and uploaded from my phone so you can see what it's like day by day for an aspiring fitness model. So, let's go. Alright guys, Friday morning, and it's official, my French dose addiction is real, because I'm about to head to Walmart real quick, I wanted some bananas to go with it, and I need more bread, so I'm picking up the Texas toast. I saw, somebody was telling me about this, I saw a post that had somebody, alright Justin, um, that had Fiber One bread. And I was like, oh man, I need to get that stuff, you know, because it's that would be great. But even then, it would still probably be thin. I like the Texas toast because it's so much thicker. It makes for like perfect French toast. Anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna go in this. Um, mission is to just get the bread, the bananas, and I need something. Else. And oh, I need more fat-free cheese. So I'm gonna go in, get those three items, and leave. Because usually I go in this Walmart and. Like, I'll have a whole list of things, and I'll manage to forget a whole bunch of stuff somehow. But when I go in here for one thing, that's when I remember everything, you know, on the planet that I need to buy. But we'll, we'll you know, be strong today. Anyway, so I'll check in with y'all. We are in what I like to call heaven. This is the Nike section of Academy. About to complete my underwear collection. This is the only color I don't have. It's loud ass color. Sorry if you can't hear me right now. Oh, medium. Yeah, I'm thinking about getting some extra in white and black since I wear. Well, I would like to wear those more often. Oh, wait, I don't think I have this blue one. What? Do I have that? Yes, you do. Okay, I do have it. <laughs> All right, check in with y'all later. I might actually get some of these shirts for work. It looks pretty pimp. All Nike everything. Somebody get Nike to sponsor me. Hi guys, uh, earlier this morning, took a picture with this shirt on, Four Giant Training, and I'm already up on the site. This is pretty cool. I need to, I don't know what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do something to celebrate this momentous occasion. I like this shot a lot. But yeah. So I'm up on the site, and I also got information from the strength guy, so I'm going to take a look over their program. They made it so I'm working out five days a week, just like I was before. Um, they kept my macros pretty much at what I was bef doing before. They have a low day in there. I don't know how they're handling refeeds. I didn't get a chance to really look at it, so I'm going to check that out, and I'll probably make a video for them tomorrow. Probably after I'm done with everything uh, for your OU and fitness, because that's going to be filmed here. So I can do that whenever. My, I'm going to try to get all this stuff for OU and fitness knocked out early in the morning. But yeah, so I'm about to go review that stuff. Um, and I'm supposed to go see The Conjuring tonight. My girl's a big horror fan. But I really don't like them at all. <laughs> but. <laughs> I'm sure this one will be okay. We'll see. If y'all are hard friends, let me know. And uh, I'll check it with y'all later. All right, guys. We just got out of the movie. Um, everybody in the theater they seemed to really enjoy it. You know, they thought it was really scary. You thought it was scary? She thought it was scary. Um, I wasn't so convinced. There's like, I don't know, I, maybe I'm just too uh, critical or rational, but like, there's like parts in the movie, I don't know if I don't, I don't want to spoil it for you, well, y'all know what it's about, and, you know, they're like talking to the priest, and they're like, oh man, you know, we need to perform an exorcism, and he's like, no, it's complicated, they're not members of the church, or baptized, like, really? 
Like, you can't. Oh, we got to get approval from, from the Vatican, you know? Like, otherwise, just let these people get possessed and, you know, let the devil run around here. Who cares? You know, whatever. God don't like people like that. So, you know, let let the devil have them. I don't, I don't know. Anyway. But there was, like, some parts that would make you jump, you know? I don't like horror movies like that. I like horror movies that have, like, a... There's only really one that I've actually liked. It was called The Skeleton Key, and it had, like, a cool little twist. It still was not very believable, but... <laughs> it, I'm just too critical or too rational, I guess, for horror movies. But anyway, I'm glad everybody else liked it. I'll wait for another, like... I don't know what I, I like suspense, action, sci-fi, comedy, everything but horror. It's hard to make a good horror movie, and I get lots of respect to the, you know, when I do like it, but um, this just wasn't one of them. But I'm glad she had such a good time. <laughs> Alright. And she's still scared. Anyway, I'll check in with y'all tomorrow.